Zone scan noise loggers can be used to localize and locate leaks. Small numbers of loggers can be deployed around suspected leak areas, or loggers can be deployed throughout the entire DMA. The loggers monitor the noise levels between 2 a.m. and 4 a.m. when pressure is highest and the background noise is lowest to identify the constant sound of a leak. During logger deployment, care is taken to ensure there is a good magnetic connection on the valve or hydrant and the serial number of the logger is noted on the map. The loggers have radio communication so they can be downloaded from a vehicle while they are being deployed on valves or hydrants. Logger found. No leak indicated. Synchronization terminated. Locker found. Caution. Leak indicated. Synchronization terminated. Locker found. Caution. Leak indicated. Synchronization terminated. Locker found. No leak indicated. Synchronization terminated. Locker found. Caution. Leak indicated. Synchronization terminated. The amplitude distribution graph for each logger helps us localize the leak position. The logger with the highest minimum noise is usually the closest to the leak. The graph is showing the number of noise samples taken for each noise level to show the consistency of the leak. This logger has a leak value of 5 and a minimum noise value of 5. The X min shows the minimum noise. This narrow peak looks like a leak, with a leak value of 68 and a minimum noise of 17.5 decibels. There is much more noise here. This is a good leak indicated by the narrow peak, highest minimum noise and the leak value of 100. This logger was placed on the water meter. It shows the leak is near, but there is a stronger noise from the previous logger on the hydrant. This logger has a much lower leak value and noise level, indicating it's further from the leak. The zone scan records correlation data to locate leak positions. We select the two loggers either side of the suspected leak position. We enter the pipe details. and the peak indicates the leak being 111 metres from logger 1 and 21.2 metres from logger 2.